Hey everybody, it's Dave Williamson, the Toy Car Collector, coming to you live. Well, no, I'm not coming to you live. I'm coming to you recorded <laughs> from the secret bunker in my underground lair where I am getting ready to open up some red lines and show them to you. I'm going to reveal them to you and they're going to be revealed to me for the first time. I'm going to need these scissors to cut them, but I'm not going to cut my business. Oh my God, his scissors have gotten out of control and they're going after my card. Oh my God. Oh no, there goes my business card. That's terrible. All those damn scissors. That's scissors. That's scissors. All right. I got to get a different pair of scissors that aren't so bad. All right, let's go at it though. That was just... That was just for entertainment's sake. I just wanted to entertain you a little bit. So, but you know what I've got here? I've got this collection of red lines and they all came to me wrapped up in these paper towels. Each, each, each lot of red lines that I get to open will be wrapped up in these paper towels. Now, I didn't do it. That was a lot of work. So I'm going to just clip these clip these uh, cellophane tapes. Cellophane tapes. Uh-oh, but it's going to make a big mess all over my gray cloth here. All right, well, let's move that out of the way. Let's just get started. Quit messing around. I'm always messing around. I do have a lot of fun making these videos and unwrapping cars to share with you and show you what's going on around. Oh, man, what is this? That's not a red line. Oh, jeez. What in the world was that doing in there? Holy smokes. Oh, here we go. A nice peeping bomb from the 1973 section. That's a nice one. Look at that. That's a real good shape. We'll just put her back there and get going on some of these more. I know there's a bunch of 73s in here somewhere in this collection. I'm getting them in a little bit at a time. A little bit so I can digest them. Ooh, look at that. That's a nice color. That's that pale light green on a 73. That is, what's that model called? It's a Tri Baby, but in 73 they changed the name to the Buzz Off. I don't know why they would do that. Why don't they just call it Tri Baby again? Don't know. Ooh, look at that. Light blue Mighty Maverick. But it's not called the Mighty Maverick, it's called the Street Snorter. Light blue. That's a pretty one. I love that one. Light blue Street Snorter. Bunch of 73s in this lot, it looks like. All right, let's get it going. Here's, ooh, ooh, hey, there's a, that's a hard to get one right there. That's a Dune Daddy in the pale, pale green. And it's actually a little paler than normal, so that's really fantastic looking. I love that. I'm going to have to go a little faster through here, I think. I've been going a little slow lately, but I need to go a little faster. So, oh, here we go. There's a pale, I always get those colors mixed up. Fluorescent lime green, fluorescent lime green twin mill. That one's got a touch up spot on the nose. The nose, the nose, the nose, all right. Oh, hey now, there's a beauty. Ooh, get, feast your eyes on that. That is a beauty. That is a buzz off and it is in the fluorescent hot pink. Fluorescent pink. That is a gorgeous, gorgeous car. All right, next up is a Dune Daddy. Is it Dune Daddy? Yes, it is. Dune Daddy, light blue, right there. So very fine. So very fine. These are models from the 73 era. This one, however, does feel like a cool one or perhaps an Inferno. In this, up, oh, it's a cool one. It's one of the 74 to 77 models. I haven't memorized exactly when that's from, but that's a that's a tough one. I don't get that one very often. I don't I just don't see too many of that model. The cool one. Zap. Yeah, you know, I get I haven't seen any of those dragsters in so long. Alright, there we go with a splitting image. That's a shell promo from 73. The splitting image in the pale green. Very nice. That's a hard to get color, so it's nice to get that. Here we've got, oh, Sweet 16, 73. Now, all these enamel colors are from 1973, and that's the Sweet 16, which is a tough model to get. And it is nice. That is extra nice. Extra, extra nice. Sure is fun opening up all these cars one by one. I'm getting a lot of them. Oh, look at that. Ice tea. Ice tea. 
That is a beauty. And that dark blue, that is a pretty color. You know, you, you never can really get the full effect of the 73s and how pretty they are because you just don't see them that often. But there'll be a lot of them in this collection coming up. Light blue on the odd job. Odd job. Ooh, that one is nice. Look at that. I love the 73s. 73s are so hard to get. You really have to concentrate and focus to get all the 73s. There's a nice one. Iced tea again, this time in the fluorescent lime green. I hope I said that right. Fluorescent lime green. Very pretty. Very pretty. Looks like this batch is mostly 73s. Oh, hey now. Wow. Exploder in orange. That's a tough one. That is a tough cookie right there. Ooh. Goodness, you know, it's tough to cook, collect those 73s. They are rare, scarce, and desirable. Eh, sorry about that. Hey, how about a Maxi Taxi? That's a 74 to 77 model. I think it's a 76 or 77, actually, but I just refer to that whole period of time as one period, 74 to 77. The 73, of course, the enamels, and then, oh, hey, check this out. Sweet 16 in yellow. Lemon yellow. It's a little lighter in person than in the screen that I'm looking at right now, but that is one tough cookie. That color, I have not seen too many of those, if any, before. Let's see what's next. Unwrapping, wrapping, wrapping. Ooh, another iced tea, this time in blue. 73s. 73s are sweet and they are rare. You can get yourself a 73 collection, that is a tough job to do, to collect 73s. Here we go, one more. Sorry about the diggle on the camera there. Trying to work my way around this system here. Light blue on the Sweet 16. Look at all these Sweet 16s and all these. Let's put these together, look at that. Very cool. Look at that, very cool. Someone was collecting very seriously to get all these. Oh, look at that. Boom. Red. Sweet 16. And super bright chrome. That is a beauty. That is a beautiful, beautiful 73 model. I'm going to go ahead and unwrap these behind the camera. Well, that's kind of... Ah, uh, that's a plum odd job. Plum odd job. That is a tough, tough color right there. Somebody, I'm going to have to bring these back to in front of the camera because it might look like I'm not actually unwrapping them. I have never seen these cars before. They open up here. This one, no, oh, this one's not so good. This is probably one of his starter cars from when he first started collecting. Not so good. Splitting image in a lime green, but not good condition, really. All right. Come on. There's a lot of tape on these. Man, can you imagine wrapping all these cars up one by one? That's a lot of work. Here's a bug eye in red. That's a nice piece. Bug eye in red. Bug eye in red. All right. Love doing this. Nothing better than opening up a mystery batch of red lines. Dark blue. Odd job. Now, I'm fortunate I get to do this because I've always been in the red line buy sell trade business most of my adult life, actually, the last 25 years. All right, yellow, yellow, bifocal. Let me show off. It was bifocal. No, it's, that's a tough piece right there. You don't get those in yellow. So the condition is not perfect, but hey, you want a yellow one, that's probably what you're going to end up with because there aren't too many of those around. And I know that. Oh my goodness, look at that. The Prowler. That is a beautiful piece right there. Look at my camera. This is a, I'm using a Galaxy Note 7. It's got the most advanced focus system of any camera. Watch this. Boom. 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 Yeah, you will not see that on any other, any other cell phone, cellular phone, smartphone. What do you want to call them these days? Let me straighten up the phone here. All right, let's keep going. Let's keep going. I want to get this whole whole bunch of these. Oh, yeah. Look at that, baby. Orange show off. Oh, boy. I'm not even sure what something like that would sell for. That is a beauty. 
but I've got to price all these to sell because that is what I have been charged with doing is sell these cars sell them or buy them or buy them and sell them yellow swinging wing still the swinging wing right yeah swinging wing even in 73 it's still the swinging wing sometimes they change the names as the years go by occasionally sometimes and we got to keep up on that all right oh i like this one look at that highway robber highway robber in lime green man look at all these 73s i had no idea i had no way of knowing what all was in this collection is sight unseen. I sold them a bunch of the cars, but still, it was kind of sight unseen. This is a funny money from the 74 to 77 era. Quite gorgeous. Really hard to get one of these in this fine of condition. Wow, this thing is beautiful. I definitely will be thinking about keeping that one. Now, I can't keep all these cars. I'd like to keep all these cars, but I can't. So... Give me a call if you want to get some yellow. It will take me a while to list all these cards, of course. It takes a lot of research and time and study and effort. But they will all be listed eventually. All right. How do you like my singing? Not bad, huh? Okay. Here's a red six-shooter. Strip teaser. Uh-huh. Okay. You know, you think I... I would be perfect by this time, even though I am mature. I am a mature man, but my memory is not that good. Okay, here we go. What is this? Double vision. Double vision. Because you can see out of both sides, right? But if you sat on that side, you wouldn't be able to drive because the steering wheel. It may be a double vision, but it's a single steering wheel. Yes, indeedy. Hey, that's making a pretty nice picture. Let's take that picture. Capture. All right. That's pretty cool. Actually, you know, if these were closer, the picture would be better. You know how that goes. So let's just move everything closer in. Let's see. what We're up about 12 minutes, so we're just about ready to end this video for this batch of red lines. But we still got a few more. It's getting late. Got to go to sleep. Oh, look at that. Twin mill. Twin mill in fluorescent lime green. Fluorescent green. Lime. Fluorescent lime. I, I never can remember what the color of that one is. Um, yep, it's just too much in my head. I can't remember everything. There it is. A swinging wing in light blue. Light blue. Light blue. Not bad. Looks like it's got a goofy rear axle. And let's see, one more. How about one more? And then we'll close for this session. No, maybe a couple more. Oh, hey. Short order. Sorry, did I lose you? Did I... My lighting. I never did exactly make my lighting perfect. But this situation in this in my light box here is working real well. Looks like, you know, you gotta check all these. Short orders can be kind of low on the axle back here. It's kind of loosey-goosey on the axle, but it's not bad. Those things are so hard to get. And light blue, I don't even know if I've ever seen a light blue before. Have you seen a light blue before? Have yeah, you collect, you know, these are called the 73 enamels, right? Oh, oh, look at that. Boom, pink. Right on, bug eye in pink. And it is gorgeous. Fantastic bug eye in pink. All right then, folks. Look at all those babies. Take that in and imagine what it would be like to have some of those in your collection. You can have some of those in your collection because everything you see here will be for sale. If it's not, if you don't see it for sale now, you feel free to call me up and ask for a price on any of these cars because I'm going to be getting so many on such a regular basis that uh, I won't have time to actually list them all right away some of them will just have to be put away but eventually they will all be out and ready to go and ready for sale for you so give me a holler if you see something you like and uh, we will talk to you then thanks a lot and as always this is the toy car collector toycarcollector.com toycarcollector.com but those damn scissors came and tacked my card and now you can't see but that's what it did say, toycarcollector.com, 503-956-3708. Thanks again for watching my fantastic video. Bye now.